California, a place filled with beautiful beaches, stunning coastlines, and big cities. However, this gorgeous state has a problem. The San Francisco Bay Delta watershed, which is located near the Sierra Nevada, is more than 75,000 miles of land that provides half of the nation's fruit and vegetable production and allows over 25 million people to have drinking water, and it's being polluted. So, how are these pollutants getting into the watershed? Well, due to sewage spills and poor sewage infrastructure, miles and miles of beaches and gallons and gallons of water are being polluted. Since the Bay Delta watershed takes in part of its water from the ocean, the bacteria, which is contaminating the ocean, is also contaminating the watershed. According to an article published by the Environmental Protection Agency, which was last updated on January 9, 2024, poor quality in the watershed and its tributaries affects terrestrial and aquatic ecosystems, drinking water, recreation, industry, agriculture, and the local and state economy. This means that toxic contaminants such as mercury, organochloride, and pesticides are contaminating our drinking water and the water that irrigates the crops that grow half of the nation's food. These toxins, when not properly treated and filtered out, can cause consumers a variety of different health problems and make them very sick. These contaminants also affect the diverse aquatic life that reside inside the watershed. These habitats are home to a variety of different aquatic species, such as Chinook salmon. This breed of salmon is one of the main sources of food for the endangered killer whale and a lot of other marine animals. However, since the watershed is being polluted, hundreds of Chinook salmon are dying and causing a huge disruption in the food chain and making more and more animals and species endangered. So, what do we do now? Well. Organizations, such as the Environmental Protection Agency, help inform others about the challenges that the Bay Delta is facing, as well as several other Delta conservation institutions and wildlife refuge organizations that help coordinate the water quality and monitoring it. You, as a viewer, can check where your water, fish, and produce is coming from, and consider testing your water and using a filter. Thank you.